Hey, what's up guys? How's it going? This is Owen here. And you are on, what is my channel called? Unraveled Tape Deck, that's what it's called. Why the Unraveled Tape Deck? Because nobody likes when that happens. Why would I choose that for a name? I, I don't know. But I thought it was cool sounding. So, uh, as you can see, I started this game off with uh, an MP5K with a silencer. And, uh... I only used it for a little while because, you know, I got hammered, so... Nobody likes that, nobody likes when you get hammered, so you change a class. And, uh, that's just embarrassing right there. I don't even care. That, that's just embarrassing. Um, in this game, it's not that special. I, uh, well, I, I, with this channel, okay, I'm, I'll get this out of my, out of my hair right now. This channel... I more wanted to post videos of me having fun than me getting great scores. I, I'd like to, to be able to give you some, some tips that might be able to make your games a little more fun, things that uh, will entertain other people as well as yourselves. And not, I, my, the way I see it in, this, in COD or any other real like online shooter or anything, you're not playing a game if you're not doing fun. As soon as something it, you get stressed, you get angry. You're you're not playing a game. You're at work. So uh, I did. I had loads of fun in this game. I, I I don't know. I'd never seen anything wrong with using a red dot sight, scar, and scavenger. Because you know the scar is terrible, terrible clip size. So you just gotta have something to from the back up there. Um. Uh, it's kind of kind of weird in case you're wondering. Uh, if you've never talked to yourself while looking at a screen, assuming you're talking to somebody else, you'll understand how truly weird it is. <laughs> it's uh, it's pretty crazy. I uh, I start off pretty rocky this game. Like I think that's my second kill. Um, two and five or something. But it does get better. I, I can't quite remember what I finished, but it's not great. But it it's good. Like the way I. The, the way it turned out, turned out well, so, um, yeah. I just figured I'd give you this video so you know what I'm all about, what I do, why I wanted to post these videos. I just found that there's so many people online now that get stressed out. You're not good at the game if you don't quickscope. You're not good at the game. You're not good at the game if you noob to. You're not good at the game unless you hack. You're just all these negative things and I just wanted to find ways to make the game more fun again for people because you know it's this game has been always been a little rocky for everyone and I thought you know people are still playing it so might as well play and have fun I'm hoping that uh, I don't bore you because because I probably run out of things to talk about but okay this this is the main reason I had so much fun this game what's coming up here I, uh, I got up to this spot and I just started pounding out the stuff and right here is what a sketch out looks like. <laughs> a bunch of grenades, you, know, you get sniped and then people start shooting at you down low and then then you get a predator. And this is the first time this has ever happened to me. I don't get my kill streaks very often, but well, I mean I don't I get my kill streaks but not this does not happen to me right here. This this made my day. And ska triple, yeah, ska triple. <laughs> you heard? Uh, it feels awkward because I'm laughing at my own jokes. Um, what could I talk to you about? Got like, yeah, I don't know, two minutes left of my video. <laughs> um, okay, one thing I found with uh, my favorite perk layout lately is I've completely abandoned sleight of hand pro and just sleight of hand in general. I still, well I still use it sometimes. But what I've found myself using is scavenger. It is, it's pro perk is probably the best perk for the blue perks that I've ever used besides marathon. Um, well, unless you're a sniper. Uh, if you're a sniper the obvious choice is sleight of hand pro. But when it comes to just offensive gameplay like I'm using, like offensive, not offensive, like as in you're like burning people, scorching them and whatnot with your, your slang and diddly whack. But 
when you're when you're playing more aggressively like this and getting hammered, even even if it's hilarious. It having well, especially if you're using the scar. Like if you've got a low clip size or you have a really fast fire rate, having that scavenger, like being able to always have extra ammo around you. Like every time you get a kill you get more ammo. Like having that available is great. It really uh, means you can you can play that you can have longer streaks by using your own weapons. You can finish your challenges faster because you're not always running out of ammo and running around. And um, I uh, yeah I, I think it, it's very helpful. Another I guess strategy I guess we call it is what I just did a second or two ago. Uh, whatever that may be called um, is gay or that's what she said it sounds like the best strategy i found is when you know when someone's in a building go in through the back take them out when they when they least suspect it it's really quite helpful especially on karachi because there's so many buildings and so many pla places people can be hiding if you get them when if you hit them from behind if you spawn behind them or you can get behind their spawn then just hammer them. Um, I know this video, this content has been a little bit rocky. It's not all that helpful. I hope my little bit of advice is helpful. Hopefully, you kind of enjoy my style of play. Hopefully, you will enjoy my other videos and maybe rate and or like. Is it called? It? Yeah, thumbs up, thumbs down, whatever. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you want to see. I'll take any challenge you give me. Uh, yeah, I'll do my best to uh, to be as entertaining as I possibly can. I'm always up for a challenge and. This has been Owen, and this has been Unravel Tape Deck.